Um, I just want to ask you, Dr. Whitehouse, I mean, this was found by the James Webb Space Telescope, uh, launched about four years ago. I mean, there are other space telescopes in, uh, you know, in production, and presumably they're constantly being uh, upgraded and new ones are coming out. NASA's got one. Europe has something called the Extremely Large Telescope, which I gather will be rolled out at some point in the near future. Can we expect, therefore, do you think, more and more of these types of discovery, the better uh, our, our, our abilities get in terms of the technology? Well, the technology of observing the sky is increasing all the time um, in terms of w what we can detect, the precision we can measure um, is actually quite remarkable even over a few years ago. And it is interesting that in the search for signals from intelligent life in space, we have so far had about 70 searches and we have detected nothing, compar nothing that is unusual or, or extraordinary. And that actually tells us something very interesting about searching for life in space, because searching for microbes on a nearby star is the ancillary to searching for intelligences such as our own. And as it was said, they could be, it's unlikely they would be as young or as dumb as we are. They could be much older than us. And the question is, and the question should be uh, engaged with more often because it, this could happen tomorrow, is will they be billionaire old cosmic princes of peace who would look on us benevolently? 